So to give you an idea of uh, how these birds sound, um, here's a, an example of two birds singing a duet. And what you'll hear um, sounds like a single bird singing, but I assure you it's, it's two birds. So here's two birds singing. Okay, so that sounds like a single bird. I don't think there's any problem with that. But we can use a bunch of techniques to figure out um, which bird sings what parts, but the birds helped us out as well. The, both the males and the females ended up singing alone. And so what you're going to hear now is the female singing by herself. And what you'll hear is that in between her syllables are gaps. And those gaps are where the male ordinarily sings during its duet. So this is a female singing by itself. So you can really hear that there's sort of gaps in between her syllables. And here's another example. The males also sang by themselves. So this is a different song, a different duet, normal duet. And then the males, they didn't sing alone very often. And when they do sing alone, they're very quiet. So you'll hear a lot of background noise, but you'll hear um, just a couple of notes that a male would sing by itself. So that was really quick. But you could hear it wasn't that the same rapid fire syllables, there was a small gap in between the two syllables. And then what we discovered, and this was the most fun for us, is that the birds will make mistakes while they're duetting. And actually, I shouldn't say the birds will make mistakes. Pretty much always the males make mistakes while they're uh, producing these duet songs. The female will be singing along, the male will be uh, singing his part of the duet, and then suddenly he'll stop. The female will keep going, and then the male will join back in again. And if you listen carefully, I'm going to play back a, a song where there's a couple of motifs, a couple of repetitions of the bird's song where they're duetting, but then the male will stop, and it'll sound like that female singing by itself. There'll be a couple of short gaps where the male should have sung, and then he'll pick up again and join her. So here's this uh, song. So hopefully you, you heard where the male messed up. And that, that's a really important signal for us. It tells us what's difficult and what's easy about singing a duet. And clearly it's hard for the males to keep up with the females in, in these long duets.